Where did this come from? Here we are again. Um, oh, yeah. Damn, I forgot. Okay, hold on. Hold on. Hold on. I need to be uh, properly dressed uh, for, for this reaction. So here we are. We are about to continue the Attack on Titan movie. I needed to take a break um, uh, from, the, from the second one. Okay, so this is part two. If you have not watched part one, go ahead and do so. Uh, I'm, I'm reacting to the full Attack on Titan uh, live action movie. Attack on Titan is one of the, it's probably like my favorite series of all time, anime wise. And uh, it, it, so there's a, there's a special place for it in my heart. So um, this movie it has taken a very different turns than what the series is. So I'm going to still try to keep it like I'm still going to try to see it for what the movie is. Uh, I'm going to pay attention to the characters. Hopefully, like even if even if they don't get the details right, they might still make a very good movie. So um, so I guess we just saw the like the the setup of the story. So uh, I think this is where we left off. Um, the super super ugly super ugly titan came out um uh, yeah <laughs> that, that that that's where it was okay so this is technically where we left off um uh here we have the titans coming into the wall and we're about to see them like destroy these people Okay, I'm going to give props to the movie. Uh, 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 let, credit where credit's due. The Titan looks scary as shit. I don't know if it's because of the CGI, <laughs> which is not that great. But, but like, regardless, the Titans look scary. Like, very scary. So, that's, uh, that's, that's point to the movie. Point to the movie. The Titans look very scary. Ugh. Yeah, like okay, yeah, definitely, po de definitely points to the movie because they look massive and scary. Ugh. <laughs> they just <laughs> okay. So yes, so here we have our non-blonde Armin, which is again, it's 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 not it's not that big of a deal. Like as long as they get the character right. The color palette of this movie is very, very gray. Uh, it helps with the aesthetic. Okay. Okay, that, that just happened. They had the balls to do that. Holy shit. Okay, so yeah, definitely definitely props. This is one good thing about the movie, okay? It's like in the original series, they had uh the Titans in the people and you could see the desperation, but I don't remember seeing ever a point where they where it felt so claustrophobic where like you could feel like it's just a massive amount of people. Uh, and the Titans are just, like, picking them like snacks. So, that is cool. That is actually very, very interesting to see. So, I like that. It, it definitely gives me a little bit, like, a, oh, shit. Like, that's... It's it, it's good. It's it's interesting. Let's put it that, that way. Not that random shot of the fucking chicken. The way they're using... So you see, the, the way they're using the colors is very important uh, to, to create that sense of claustrophobia because all the colors are muted. Everything is white and gray and kind of green and uh, icky. Uh, so you have a sense that everything is kind of melting. If all the colors were 
popping and vibrant, not only would you feel safe in a way, but also there would be more definition between skin tones and walls and sky and everything. So here it just it gives gives more sense of yeah. You see how everything is just like a blob of nothingness. And holy shit, that fucking that is scary as fuck. Like this this guy looks like David Grohl a bit. <laughs> Shout out to David Grohl. Who's laughing? Do you guys hear that laugh? Who's who's laughing? Ooh. Are they going to the church? Okay, Aaron is like, "Hey, I'm a, I'm I'm gonna save the people, you know. I'm gonna I'm gonna do it," which which is something Aaron would do. Oh shit! Fuck, poor Mikasa. Mikasa's left. Okay, so okay, okay, okay. So they are definitely like throwing the 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 series out the window. They're not doing. They're not doing Attack on Titan. Uh, they're they're doing their own their own story. Okay, got it. So we're not looking at Aaron. We're looking at Aaron. We're not looking at Mikasa. We're looking at uh, Tukasa. Uh, you're, yeah, Mikasa Tukasa. Yes, Tukasa. So um, so yes, she is. Uh, so this are this is their own interpretation of the story. So even if they don't follow the the original plot. Hopefully, it'll still be a good movie. Um, we're 22 minutes into the movie. And sadly, I don't have a reason to give a shit about any of these characters yet. Uh, they haven't given me one. Uh, one reason. Two. Uh, they, they just have this built mystery. So hopefully, we'll see a little bit more character development as the movie progresses. It's just like, no, you're staying out. He has the presence to shut everyone up in the room. Yeah, I mean, come on. You you saw the things, like, go through concrete walls. This wooden church is not going to do much. Eren definitely wants Mikasa. Like, at, at this point, like, it's... Oh, shit. Okay, wait. Okay. Fuck. No, don't do that shit. Don't do that shit. Okay, she looks scary as shit. Let's uh let's be honest. Did she fucking laugh? Okay. It's their own fucking new universe. It's their own movie, alright? <laughs> that stupid laugh. Why are all the Titans laughing in this goddamn movie? Like the colossal titan was just like hur, hur, hur. now this bitch is like, <laughs> like So the Titans in this universe have more vocal cords, I guess. I want to see a singing titan then. No, don't. Okay, are they gonna kill Mikasa off? Are they? Are, are they actually going to kill Mikasa off? Show the body, or it doesn't count. Come on, show the body, or it doesn't count. See, that's what I'm saying. Like, why? Why did it go inside the inside the building? Like, these things can clearly go through concrete. Oh shit, okay. If they actually kill Mikasa in this, in, like, this early on, it's gonna be so fucking dumb. Where did this come from? Like, legit, where the fuck did this come from? Oh, and they're actually using the jacket, like, uh, like towards the rib. Uh, so it's just the garrison that has the different uniform, and this division has the kind of correct uniform, and they have the wings of freedom. I like the I I like the look of the alphas. They're like dirty <laughs> unlike in the uh un unlike in the series that are like pristine all the time like this actually looks more realistic but 
I, okay, so I know what this is, but the movie did not explain that there's different factions of the military. The movie hasn't explained the rules of the world or hasn't explained like what everything is. So if I was to see it like a brand new eyes and I'm seeing this different logo, I'm like, so wait, what's going on? Um, there was never established in any sort of exposition kind of where you are and what the thing is. So you don't know. Like, again, I get that this is not Attack on Titan, uh, This the, the anime. This is Attack on Titan, the live action movie. And they clearly are going in their own, like, different ways. But the, the, the problem is, it's still as a movie, you need to establish your world if you're going to expose someone to a world that is not their own. Like, this is not earth this is fantasy earth and there must be rules there must be uh, things and so far they haven't explained anything they haven't given a base of understanding to the viewer so this instead of being like a epic reveal what the fuck is that logo the walls are built by a four-year-old let me tell you <laughs> like like it's not a fucking circle but anyways Hanji! Ah! It's Hanji! Okay, she looks good. She 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 looks good. Shikishima. Captain Shikishima. Is that an actual character? Like they, they have a, a pantheon of characters to choose from. They're they're making a shit ton of them, like on the fly. Okay, I kind of want to rewind it a little bit, but it gave me the impression that this is the, like, it feels like this is the, I don't know. She just said something that, I, I don't know, I, I might be, now we have, this is what got me, okay. Th this is, this is, no, what the, f no, go back. Yeah, our days of fearing the titans are over. Now we have the omnidirectional mobility gear. So that that's that's kind of what I'm like scratching my head over. Does that mean that this is the first time that they've invented this shit? Like they just came up with it? This 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 okay, this is where it, it's kind of clashing, okay? Um again, even at its own movie, you're going to tell me that they came up with this technology in less than a year or something because they, our character's already grown. Uh, so, I don't know. That That's, like, conflicting time. And clearly she doesn't even, like... Clearly she doesn't have control of the thing. So, I, I guess in, in this world, like, all the military branches have just different uniforms. Don't tell me the fucking captain did the <laughs> wrong salute. <laughs> like, he went like this. Wait, well, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Wait a fucking minute. Wait a fucking minute. Okay, yeah. This is like super picky and this this is probably my editing eyes right now but you can see the shoulder not on this guy right here but on the one next to him his arm is is to the side okay so he's not on he, he doesn't have the, the arm in the back like the whole salute is like having the arm on the back but you can clearly see like even the guy behind him he's he has his arm like crossed like this I don't know, that detail, like, ticks, <laughs> like sticking me up a bit. Like, guys, you couldn't even get this right. Like, you can see on the position of the arms that the... Again, this is the fucking universe. Maybe maybe they're just supposed to put the hand like that, and this hand can do whatever they want. It can be, like, doing a peace sign, like, metal horns. Okay. 
I'm just gonna give it give gonna give it that, but God damn it, what the fuck? So that's Aaron, right? Oh, I, I'm I'm sorry. Aaron. He's Aaron. Aaron. A Aaron. Okay, so this is a very important part, I guess. Like legit a very important part. Because this is where we will finally get to see some motivation from Aaron or Armin. Like, clearly they're in the military, and they're supposed to be in this faction where they're about to go and kill Titans, right? So, okay. That's understood. Uh, but, like, you can assume the reasons, but you don't know the reasons yet. Like, okay, he can just be sad, but it's not that doesn't necessarily mean that he wants to join the military to kill them. This we're 31 minutes into the movie, and again, we don't have yet a reason to understand the motivations or understand the characters per se. So I'm kind of getting worried. So this is this is a scene would be a very good moment to do it, where he can just go off and be like. Bitch, I'm doing this because I want to, like, or something. So that's Sasha. <laughs> Mosin. It's not Shingen Sina anymore, I guess. Do you want to know exactly why I'm kind of, like, worried about, like, understanding these characters and finding their, like... Why should I care about them? It's because there's really nothing to care about. Like, at the beginning, when Eren was running with everyone from the Titans, he says, I need to go and check back home. So that started a threat. But we never got to see if he got home or not. So... Did he need to get get back home to like check on the stove, or to check on like in the original series his mom or something? So, as far as we know, the only people he ha he has given a shit about has been Armin and Mikasa. Uh, Mikasa is dead for for him into his eyes, and sadly Mikasa is like he he seems like a he's mourning the death but not like. Uh, you know, uh, he's kind of over the death in a way. Like, he doesn't seem inspired to do anything for that death. Joining the military means nothing, because they kind of did it because they kind of have to. We we don't know why they did it, but they, so far, that's, that's, that's the thing. They just did it. And there has been no meaning behind the symbols. The symbols are there, but it hasn't been explained why the symbols are there. So the fact that they're in the military doesn't mean anything because we don't know the divisions of this military. So as you can see, there's many things that the movie has already established that hasn't given us a reason to care for. Lil. Who the fuck is Lil? Let's kill this bitch. What? Do Titans have nipples? Is that legit what you're about to ask? All right. Have some guts. She's a good Hanji. She's a, she's a good Hanji. Sanagi. I didn't know I had my twin evil bro brother play in the movie, so... Uh, guys, this is Jose. Jose, guys. They have lights? Yeah, they have lights! What the fuck? They have fucking... What the fuck is this shit? They have lights. They have military tanks. Dude, they're just defeating their own fucking purpose at this point. Like, they make the 3D gear look silly right now. Because they're showing that they have technology to do something more effective against these goddamn titans. Like, like... I can't believe they're making the, the 3D gear look so silly at this point because if you're showing that you have electricity and military fucking vehicles, like, 
you can only assume then that they have the capability to create a weapon effective enough to not put so much danger of the user. So why would they fly around like Spider-Man with swords if they can clearly have the technology to create guns? Attack on Titan and cars. Uh, they have the ability to have combustible fuel. Why did they decide to go and fly with wires and swords instead of trying to just make more helicopters and attack the bitches from, from high up? God damn it. They have lights. They, they have electricity. Like, soon enough, they're going to have iPhones and shit. Always feed me. They met, like, literally two hours ago. What's she talking about? You always feed me. He's fed you twice. <laughs> like... A child. Lesson of life. If you ever see a child at night in the middle of a field next to some cows, run. Like, just, 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 just run. How did she know there was a child? She's been walking for like a mile now. Hiana. Who the fuck is Hiana? You cannot hear it. That's just your schizophrenia. Like... Uh, okay, who who the hell is Kiana? Like, they're making characters just, like, left and right. Baby Titan. And this is why I don't want to have kids. That was legitimately creepy. Again, I give it, give it, give it props to the movie whenever, whenever it's deserved. Uh, the Titans are scary as shit. They're not accurate to the original series, but still, they're scary as shit. Uh, Baby Titan was definitely like a very creepy scene. Not gonna lie. That reminds me of the scene from Jurassic Park. You know, like shooter. Oh shit! Ah oh, shit! What the fuck, man? The Wait. Did my guy actually, like... He actually threw him. He's stronger than fucking Hulk. Like... Is this fucking Levi? Looks like Levi. Okay, at least we're gonna get like a badass Levi scene. How did he call him? Shikishima? Wait, fuck. Okay, so my twin brother Jose is the Titan killer? Don't fucking tell me. Don't fucking... And now people who has never seen Attack on Titan is going to be like, Is that the girl? Uh, Alright. I guess. Okay, so... So... He's not Levi. Okay, yeah, that's that's where I'm gonna stop. Okay, so okay, recap. He's not Levi. Is Shiki Shikishima Chiki Bamba whatever his fucking name is, and uh, and Mikasa is like the the new apprentice, I guess. Okay. Okay, we. We ah, shit. Okay, we have the ability to make cars, to make electricity, to make plastic, and concrete. We have the ability to do those things, mind you. 
And the most effective way of killing a titan is by flying around with a sword. Even though we have a fucking bomb and they know what it is. Because at the beginning they're like, oh, don't stomp on it. Like, oh, it's it's a it's a it's a bomb, it could explode. So they know what it does. They could easily replicate it now. And they there was a fucking helicopter too. So they could easily replicate it as well. But no, fucking flying around with swords. All right. Okay, guys, thank you so much for joining me. Uh, let's continue tomorrow for more Attack on Titan movie. I don't know if you are liking this or not. I'm not entirely sure if I am. Um, but yeah. So, all right. Uh, part three coming tomorrow. Leave a like and comment on the comment section. I feel my soul going away. <laughs> I'm not going to lie. All right. Thank you, guys. Bye.